Mary Meet Eclectic Mystics. I'm Beverly Crowder, the uh, Whimsical Eclectism Witch. I am also the owner and, well, I guess you could say all hatter <laughs> of uh, my business, uh, Magically Eclectic LLC. Today is a life update as well as an announcement for where we're going to be taking the channel. Um, we've been having a lot of issues around our home lately in regards to uh, nosy Karens and it has actually gotten to be to the point to where we've got the law involved and it's made it difficult for me to continue working with everything that I've been trying to do. So I've been kind of working in the background and doing some uh, behind the scenes things and making plans as far as where things are going to end up going from here. Um, I have been developing things on my Patreon. That link is patreon.com slash magically eclectic LLC. The link will be down in the description below. Um, I was going to do a blog, but I'm just going to put everything on Patreon. I need to be a little bit more mindful on how much I take on and try and keep it to where there's a healthy balance. So some of the things that I had planned that I was intending on bringing into fruition and the uh, intensity I was planning on working as far as getting everything taken care of and making sure that new products were brought into the shop and uh, more videos and everything were going to be um, created to go into that and everything else it's that's not going to happen in the same way it's um it's going to be slightly different it's still going to be about the same amount of content but it's going to be a lot more condensed <laughs> Sorry about that. It's our dogs, our uh, fur babies hear something outside that they don't really like. <laughs> um, as far as the channel goes, Weston, I don't need your help. Thank you, buddy. But as far as the channel goes, I'm going to be bringing in magical content. And I'm going to be explaining more in depth on what the items that I create in the shop are able to be used for. I'm going to explain a little bit more behind it and the intention with it. Things that I'm not going to be able to really explain on Etsy simply because Etsy requires all magical uh, creators to um, to claim them as a curio. And that's not technically the case, but they've also had a lot of issues where uh, things have made, made it a lot harder to be able to accurately describe everything for those of us that create magical items. Uh, for example, we can't use the word amber on anything. We can't use amber itself in any of our items. Um, we can't use uh, amber to describe the color. Um, even those, uh, the shop owners that have amber as their name are getting deemed because of the uh, whole amber fiasco. And the uh, magical properties for each of the gemstones, for instance, we're not allowed to put that in the description because they consider it to be uh, giving unsolicited medical advice. So, I can I can understand where they're coming from, 
but at the same time it's very very frustrating as a uh, magical shop owner and a magical content creator as well as a magical practitioner to go through and try to explain it in the way that would be the most beneficial for you and ultimately that's my end goal I want to make sure that what I'm providing and the descriptions that you're getting as well as the different uh, the different properties and the things that they can be used for you know as much in-depth information as possible <coughs> excuse me I want to make sure that you're getting the most out of what you're seeing what you are you know reading before you go through and decide well this uh this wand says that it's a water wand and that um it's a uh, perfect use for water rituals and you know it's got this uh, clear quartz on it but there's no information on it what is that clear quartz supposed to represent I can't put that information in the the listing because Etsy won't let me yes I do have water wands <laughs> um, I'm also working on the other elemental wands but I I do have some wands in the shop and I have some witch hats and a few other things uh, these earrings for instance these will be listed uh, probably in the next couple of weeks <coughs> sorry I have a tickle in my throat <laughs> but I'm going to be providing not only information on the different items that I create and put in the shop but I'm also going to be creating some magical content about what it means to be an eclectic magic practitioner spiritualist which is my personal put together I guess you could say magical path because I don't pardon me I don't stick with one type of magic and excuse me a lot of uh, eclectic witches don't really you know, do that either but you know just this is a topic for a whole new video to be honest but uh, those that practice magic especially eclectic witches you know, you understand that magic is vast. It's not really ending. There's multiple paths within a path. So it's up to you ultimately to decide exactly what path you want to walk down. Since you're the only one that can actually walk your path, you need to make sure that it's what's right for you. <coughs> Pardon me. Son of a biscuit eater. <laughs> anyway, um, I could go on and on, but this is only supposed to be a life update and you know, channel update as well. So I'm going to go ahead and leave this here. If you are interested in joining my Patreon, the link will be down below in uh, the description. I have uh, very little content up right now, but I'm still working on it. That's one of the things that I'm uh, intending on continuing after I upload this video. And um, I'm in the middle of transferring the blogs from the blog I was actually getting ready to launch over to my patreon and I will have a few things that are available to the public the first 
entry level for uh, the Patreon is $5 a month. And that comes with a seven day free trial. So, you know, you'll be able to kind of poke around a little bit and kind of see a little bit. It is very, very limited though, because that is, you know, it's only for being able to see a few of the posts and for, uh, pardon me, for being able to take part in the polls. And those polls are going to be the different uh, types of content that end up coming into the videos and quite possibly, um, <coughs> pardon me, quite possibly it'll also end up being the more in-depth videos that will end up going up on Patreon itself. So... Anyway, I hope that uh, you have a blessed day, and I hope that uh, things go well for you. Remember to take care of yourself and uh, to, you know, I have tr uh, trouble with this one too, so I'm saying this one to myself as well. Remember to believe in yourself. Take care. Mary Park, and I can't wait to see you. Bye.